<laughs> Lane's like two stepping over. Getting there. down to it. <laughs> all right, what well, is time for today's talker? Today's talker is all about a toddler who's gone viral for her friendship with her doll. But let's be clear here. This isn't just any doll, it's a creepy doll. Yeah. Very creepy. The doll's name is Chloe. Creepy Chloe, I guess we could call her. <laughs> Three-year-old Briar was immediately drawn to the doll when she saw her at a Halloween store. Where else would you find that? Oh my gosh. Her mother gave in, bought her the doll with its cracked yes, face, would. its red light-up eyes. It even has a demonic laugh on top of all of this. Hey, she did nickname her Creepy Chloe. But Briar loves Chloe. And when she took her on her trip to Disney World, the staff there were was also spit. <laughs> I bet. Well, in full princess attire, Chloe got Briar and her mom special treatment, including a special cupcake Ooh. and a backstage tour of the haunted mansion. Appropriate. Yes, pictures of the creepiest doll on earth in the happiest place on earth with her loving owner went viral on social media. <laughs> so, wow. Oh my goodness. And no, if I was the mom, you. I'd be taking her into every store saying, do you want this? Yeah, yeah. like how about this, this one? one? How about this one? doll? How about, uh, yeah. <laughs> I, it's weird. I usually let Riley, especially like kind of have whatever, like, you know, let her wear yeah. whatever she wants right. to wear, all that kind of stuff, but There's I don't know. There's a line. There might be a line with this one. <laughs> like, I feel like I would, be, you know, like, you have to no. make suggestions though. And then you have to have it so that they're making the decision yes, too. So think. it's like, uh, yeah. Yeah. don't you like this one? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this one's got better. cool frills or this one's got, I don't know, blue had <laughs> something like the little thing. Not All right, well, not that. We got another story to get to. Uh, this one may stir the pot as uh -huh. we have some Chicagoland natives as uh -oh. part of this team. Some of the other ones were out there dancing. Uh, Chicago may soon need to change its name from the Windy City to the Rattiest City. Ooh, wow. After topping Orkin's top 50 Rattiest Cities list yet again, yet again. You guys Orkin, just had to throw that in there. Yet again. again. <laughs> Orkin released the list yesterday and for the eighth consecutive year, the Midwest city takes the top spot. Okay, so Orkin says New York, which you would probably think is number one, earned the number two spot. Los Angeles came in third. That surprises me as an LA date if I never saw a rat. Uh, we've got the rest of the cities up on your screen right now. And if you're wondering if Bruce City made the list, it did. Milwaukee fell to 21st place following Miami. Huh. Oh, wow. You yeah. just don't think of warm weather places of, you know, where the rats are. And when you do go you know, to New York, you, if you don't see one in the subway, then I guess you didn't really ride the subway. Mm. What about Chicago? I, I'm, Elaine, I know you're a Chicagoan. What do you think? No slander, Elaine. Her and I are on the same team. I was going to say, there better not be slander coming from in there. I mean, yeah, we have rats, but, but I just... I take offense to the rattiest city. I'll take Windy, but you know, there's there's rats everywhere, but they're they're really gross. So if they say they're there, they're there. I mean, I like, I love Chicago, but I mean, you know, there's a lot of rats there apparently. Maybe as part of her I've home- I've never seen a rat. Elaine, have you seen a rat in Chicago? Unfortunately, yes, <laughs> I have. <laughs> you let me I down, have. girl, you uh, let me down. No, they, ha I, I'm not, why would I lie? I can't lie, yes, <laughs> I've true. seen them. Um, they, and it's hard, cause you know, they have like signs on like posts sometimes, like, you know, don't leave like your garbage yeah. out. Cause like rats may show up. So I'm not saying that, that Orkin is wrong. I'm just saying, I don't know if we should be number one. Yeah, we're upset about that's it. That's all. Yeah, Adriana, as part of your home services, yeah, that's all. I'm just uh, upset. Goods, the things that you do, do you also remove, you know, rats and mice and things? <laughs> Rat removal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just do it all, right? Yeah. I mean, oh, so here, here's the thing. I have family in Chicago. I was born in Chicago. I have family there, so I go to Chicago a lot. Of a lot. My brother lives there. I've never seen a rat in Chicago. So I, I don't know what they're talking about. I don't know how they measured this, but their it's business not the was probably city. down in I'll Chicago. They needed an update, <laughs> needed some extra business, so they just said that. All right, thanks, guys.